Uno, 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 uno. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Can you hear me? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yes, okay. teacher. Okay. Okay, good to see you. How was your holiday yesterday? It was good. Relaxing. Yes. No, uh, yes, I yes. kind of. Okay, so welcome back. Okay, today it's an extraordinary day because normally on Friday we don't have classes. So I know you want to be in a party probably or doing something else, watching Netflix movies, but we have class. So let us start. We have to continue with the platform Okay, because we missed some exercises. So let's check what it's missing. And remember, you have to complete all the exercises on the platform with a grade of 80% of more or more. Okay, this is already done. We already learned the vocabulary and the there is and there are. Okay, this part, yes, is missing. Okay, we have um, the phrases there is and there are to talk about things that we have in a in a place okay and also we have a, a a way to say if we don't have that 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 object in the place so let's check only wait because i think i have a PowerPoint about this. Did we have homework for today? Yes, right? No. No. Yes. No. Oh, I sure. Mm. Questions. Quiero ver. What was the last topic? No. We stop on, on the vocabulary, right? Yes, you're right. Okay. ¿Cómo vamos con la plataforma? It's complete, remember? Yes, I finish. Finish, okay. No teníamos una homework de las routines. No. No. No, no. Okay. I'm going to trust you. Voy a confiar en ustedes. Okay. So for the reason that are, let me check the manual.
simple present questions, the reading, the vocabulary, we did the conversation, mm, we make a review of the short answers, the vocabulary, Mm. This part is missing, I think. Okay. We already learned some vocabulary uh, related to furniture. Okay, furniture, it's all the objects that you can place in a house or in an office. Okay, like the big ones. Okay, that's how the furniture. Okay, and here we have... Uh, Armchairs, okay, armchairs are different from the sofa. Okay, in an armchair, you only have one seat, but in the sofa, you have two, three or more seats. Okay, then we have the stove. Okay, the stove, it's the, in which you cook. The curtains, okay, curtains. Pictures, okay, pictures could be uh, artistic or could be uh, about your family, your daughter, your son, okay. The clock, okay, the clock, the bed, the table, okay, the table, the that in which you have your food, okay? That's the table or to work. And you have a small one, a coffee table, which you place in the living room, okay? The coffee table normally is in the living room. Okay, mm -hmm. then we have the bookcase, dresser, chairs, microwave oven, refrigerator, mirror, rug, lamps, television, and desk. Okay, now we are going to complete the chart. We are going to, to categorize the vocabulary in the room which corresponds. Okay, so let's start with the things that you can find in the kitchen. Okay, we have table, stove. What else we can find in the kitchen? Refrigerator. Okay, refrigerator. Microwave oven. Microwave. Microwave oven. Stuff. Microwave oven. Okay, what else? Is stuff. Cocina. A stove. It's already here. Table, a stove, refrigerator, microwave oven. Knives. Mm. In some kitchens, uh, yes. Which one? Chairs. Chairs. Okay, but most of the times they are part of the dining room. Okay, nowadays, we don't use the dining room anymore because we eat in front of the television in the living room. <laughs> but yes, the dine in the dining room, it's supposedly we have a table. In in some uh, malls or uh, places in which they used to sell 
uh, dining rooms, okay, the table and the chairs. Nowadays, you it's difficult to find. Ahora ya ni lo venden ya los los comedores. Okay, only in in a few places. Okay, so the dining room table and okay. chairs. Okay. Chairs. Chairs. What else? Clock. A clock. Okay. Lamp. Pictures. Pictures. Yes. With fruit or something beautiful. Okay. I think only that. Um. Probably no. Okay. Let's move to the living room. Sofa. Sofa, okay. Television. Television, the most important. Coffee table. A book case. Book case. Book case, muy bien. Case. Desk. Roll. Okay, a desk, mm, probably coffee in the table. bedroom is better. The coffee table, yes. Okay. A clock. Table, a clock, okay. Mirror. Lamps. Mirror Lamp. in the bedroom. Lamps, okay. yes. Portains. Roll. Muy bien. Bye. Okay, yes. Eso ya está frío, se lo come ya. We don't have enough space. Okay. And in the bedroom. Dresser. Bed. Dresser. Yes. Muy bien. Lamps. Bed. Mirror. Yes. Lamps. Mirror. Okay. Dresser. Dresser, yes, ahí está. Desk. Desk. What else do you need to work in a dress in a desk? Lamps. Lamps, yes. Maybe a television. A television. Okay, if you have a desk, you need something else. Chair. Table. Chair. Table. A chair. A chair. You need a chair to sit and work in your desk. Oh. Okay. Roll. Correct. Curtains. Curtains. Yes. Clouds. Which one? Clouds. Reloj. Lock. Okay, clock. clock. Mirror. A mirror, yes. Excellent. Okay, so here we have the things that commonly we have in those rooms. Okay, questions? About this part, I think it's easy. So, so, <laughs> so, so. <laughs> you, you have to practice, you have to practice, but um, pronunciation microwave probably this is the most difficult microwave, microwave oven, refrigerator. Okay, rug, rug, television, and um, okay, no pusimos los armchairs en ningún lado. But the armchairs correspond to the living room. Yes, in the living room. Okay.
So let's continue. We have a conversation. Okay. This apartment is great. Mm, did we practice this conversation? Yes, right? No. 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 Only this, right? Yes, the leg view. Okay. Wait a minute. Okay, we're going to work in breakout rooms. Ya han trabajado en los breakout rooms. Ah, yes. pero tenemos. Yes. Solo que hay algunos que están trabajando, otros que no se van a poder. Vaya, let me organize. Muy bien, in pairs, you are going to practice the conversation. I will give you five minutes. Okay, you are going to practice once, then you are going to switch, luego van a cambiar, and then we are going to come back, okay, to the, to the, to the meaning, meeting. Okay, only let me put the conversation. Let's listen and practice the conversation. This apartment is great. Thanks. I love it. But I really need some furniture. What do you need? Oh, I need lots of things. There are some chairs in the kitchen, but there isn't a table. And there's no sofa here in the living room. And there aren't any chairs. There's only this lamp. So let's go shopping next weekend. Now, let's learn how... Okay. Questions about the vocabulary? Some vocabulary words, pronunciation. Maybe some furniture. What? How say? For furniture. Furniture. Uh, furniture. Dijimos que era ah, furniture. como. Ajá, furniture. La, las tiendas de venta en. No, son los objetos. No. Oh. Objetos grandes que se encuentran en una casa. Ah, ok. Ajá, como la mesa, la, el escritorio, eh, las sillas. And that's the furniture. Ok, understand that. Ok, so let's make it the breakout rooms and you're going to practice. Okay, you will have five minutes. Solo, ¿quiénes son los que no? Quiero ver. Los que no podrían, porque me dijeron que por ahí alguien estaba trabajando. Somebody is, is working. Todos podrían, entonces. Ok. Vaya, se unen, entonces no vayan a dejar a su compañero ahí colgado. Ok. Voy 
We are 26. So we need 13. Okay, go to the breakout room. Audelia, oh, okay, Audelia. Oh, and Hidalgo. You go to the record room. Tienen que unirse a la sala del grupo pequeño. Ahí les tendría que haber salido una notificación, denle clic y se unen. Y Lorena, Álvaro, Hidalma, bueno, Hidal, Hidalma y Naudelia, no. Jocelyn, Claudia, hay que irnos al, a la sala de grupos pequeños. Yo me uní, pero solo yo estaba, por eso me salí. Solo estaba yo. Es que Jocelyn está aquí afuera también, no ha entrado. Ah. Ahorita creo que acaba de entrar. Una sí. Ahorita veo. Álvaro, hay que unirse. Teacher, yo estaba sola. Sí, esperen un momento porque ahorita se están, se están uniendo. Ah, y va, y yo estoy, a... estoy reorganizando. Los que están solos los estoy metiendo a otro grupo. Ah, va. Uh -huh. Y yo dije, qué raro. Vuelva a unirse, Araceli. Me va a aparecer de nuevo, le digo. La voy a mover. Ok. Hello, Idalma. Hola. Hola. Medio, medio. Hola, Miss. Yo tengo problemas con la conexión porque todavía voy en el transporte para mi casa. Ok, sí, este, por eso la, la dejé en un grupo así sola, pero ya vamos a, ya la, ya, ya vamos a unirnos nuevamente. Ok. Okay, o sea, no, no, no le asigné pareja porque, por eso, porque todavía va, va en, en el bus. Pues muchas gracias, Miss.
Okay, could you practice? Did you finish the conversation? Yes. Yes, teacher. Yes, excellent. Okay, so we are ready with the next topic. Okay, some students are missing. Hey, did you practice? It was good? Yes, teacher. Okay. So let's see the now there is and there are. Okay, the explanation and then we have the exercises. Okay. So we have, there is, if we only have one object, okay? And there are for two or more objects. Also, como lo vimos en clases anteriores, okay, we have a, okay, a or an, to, refer one, okay, which is the same to say one, okay, there is one bed or there is a bed, okay, remember A, if the object start with consonant and N, if the object start with vowel, okay, um, for example, there is an armchair in the living room. Okay, si mi, si mi palabra empieza con vocal, I'm going to use an. Luego. Um, este sería para el caso del singular. There is. Y... Para hacerlo negativo, ok, sería there isn't. Así como lo, como hemos visto el verb to be en negativo, ok. There isn't, ok. There isn't a table in the kitchen, ok. ¿Qué sería no hay? There isn't, ok. There isn't a table in the kitchen. Y luego tenemos, there's no sofa in the bedroom. Okay. Que también eh, tiene una connotación negativa. O sea, que, que no, no hay tampoco. Okay. There's no sofa in the bedroom. Or there isn't a table in the kitchen. Okay. Cualquiera de las dos formas sería para referirnos cuando no, no hay, no, o no están esos objetos. Eso sería en singular. Y luego tenemos plural form, there are. Ok. Para singular dijimos que íbamos a usar a or an. Y para plural vamos a usar some. Ok, some. Este, this is an indefinite article, un artículo indefinido. Entonces, nos dice que hay más de uno, pero no nos dice específicamente la cantidad de cuántos son. Ok, pueden ser three, pueden ser four, pueden ser two, pueden ser six. Ok, no sabemos el número exacto. También podemos utilizar el número, eh, si no vamos a, a decir, no queremos decir son, ok, you can say there are four chairs in the kitchen, ok, también se puede, o puede utilizar, como le digo, una forma general, ok, there are some chairs in the kitchen, but probably you don't know how many chairs, you know that you have, 
but you don't know exactly how many you have. Ok, entonces son es para plural, pero de forma indefinida. Ok, no sabemos la cantidad exacta. Y luego también tenemos las formas negativas, ¿verdad? There are no chairs in the living room. Y te debo, there aren't any, ¿ok? Este sería para plurales, ¿verdad? There isn't a y en plural, there aren't any. There aren't any chairs in the living room. ¿Ok? Esto sería con respecto a there is and there are. And then I think we have the exercise on the platform. Well, questions about this part? Yes, Karen. Yes, este, Miss dice que hay veces en algunas oraciones se ocupa el there are not. O sea, no, eh, no sé en qué caso se usa eso o si es en ciertos puntos, porque se ocupa el not. Eh, la diferencia es que el there are no es como, como que no hay como que no existe, pero el not es como la negación. O sea, uno es como, es que no, 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 no sé cómo explicar la diferencia, pero sí es lo mismo, pero una es como más general. Por ejemplo, there are no, que okay, is more general. El, y el not es que sabemos que no hay. O sea, las dos son negativas, pero una es más general y la otra, digamos que, eh, es como que... Es afirmativa. No, siempre son negativas, las dos. There are not es más There afirmativa. are not es afirmativa. Uh -huh. creo, creo que en la conversación... Eh, There are some chairs, but there isn't a table. There are no sofa. Uh, vaya, por eso, por ejemplo, este. There is no sofa. O sea, porque está como vacío el, el espacio. O sea, no existe, por decirlo así. No es, o, o, y el otro es no hay. Como es, esa es como, como la, la diferencia. Pregunta hipotética nada más. Ajá, es que, o sea, there's no, es como, o sea, no hay ninguna, ninguna probabilidad de que el objeto esté ahí. And there, there isn't, o sea, puede ser no hay, ok, o eh, no está aquí. Podría usarse de esa manera también. Ok, there isn't a chair in the living room. Ok, o sea, puede que sí hay, pero están, en, por ejemplo, en el bedroom. O sea, sí tengo chairs, pero no están aquí en, en el living room, sino que están en el bedroom. ¿Ya? Y en cambio, de, eh, cuando yo digo there's no, es porque no tengo en ningún lado. ¿Ok? Ok, Miss. Thanks. Ok. And I think here that you have the, the options. Aquí que me imagino yo que vi por ahí que algunos estaban preguntando también de estas. Y dice, I have some chairs in the kitchen, ¿ok? Eh, dice, write each, each sentence uh, in a different way, ¿ok? Selecting the correct word. Ok, so we are going to say the same, vamos a decir lo mismo, pero en otras palabras. So, I have some, nos quedaría como? There are some. There are, are some, okay. There are some chairs in the kitchen. Okay, I have a stove in the kitchen. There is a. There is a stove in the kitchen, or there's, 
there's a stove in the kitchen. I don't have a refrigerator. There's no. No. There's no refrigerator. There's no, there's no refrigerator. Ok. Correcto. O sea, aquí es que, o sea, yo no tengo. No hay en ninguna parte de la casa. I don't have curtains on the windows. There are no curtains in the window. There are no. There are no curtains in the window. Okay. I don't have any rocks on the floor. There are no. There are no. Rocks on the floor. There aren't any. There aren't any. O there are no. Algunos me dijeron there are no y otros me dijeron there are there aren't any. There are, there are, there are no. no. There are no. Ok. Aquí me imagino que es donde tenían la duda de cuál íbamos a usar y por qué. Yes? Creo, sí, creo que la que acepta es there are no. There are no. Ok. Let's check. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yes, María Angélica. Solo una duda. ¿Por qué nos pidieron la, la sección 2 terminada y todavía no habíamos recibido la clase? Yes. Uh, <laughs> eh, it's supposedly the... The platform is designed to be autonomous. O sea, la plataforma está diseñada para que usted pueda ir viendo los temas y todo. Y, y con la información que tiene en la plataforma, usted la puede contestar. But, digamos que como les mencionaba por ahí, una de las, de las encargadas de, de inglés corporativo, las clases son, digamos, como más prácticas. Or, well, the most important is to practice here in the class. And also to, to check. Por eso les decía yo que es más como para ver si algo no quedó muy claro de los temas. Pero en teoría, con lo que usted ve en la plataforma, puede contestar lo que es las preguntas que, de los ejercicios que aparecen ahí. Okay, gracias, teacher. Y digamos que ahorita porque es, esta semana es como la más apretada porque cubrimos dos secciones y porque tuvimos una clase a medias, vamos un poquito atrasados. Pero por lo general, ya día jueves, eh, yo realizo ya una actividad extra que ya no es de plataforma porque ya se cubrió todo, todo, todo lo, 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 el material. Entonces, digamos que esta porque cubrimos dos secciones en una y por los minutos que, que, no, que no tuvimos. Entonces, no porque quizás ya lo hubiéramos, ya lo hubiéramos completado todo. Ok, en the last topic is about uh, reading. It's a reading. I have here another exercise. For the reason there are. Okay. Uh, number one, Álvaro. There is or there are. I'm sorry. There is? Two pictures, two pictures in the bedroom. Para plurales. Eh, 
Gonzalez. There are. There are, yes, correct. Entonces, como si están ahí, there are. There are two pictures in the bedroom. Thank you. Okay, Eric, number two. There is. Brown there book. is a brown bookshelf. Okay. It's brown? Are you sure it's brown? Or is white? Or is brown? It's, it's white or... Or gray. gray. Entonces, ¿cómo nos quedaría? Eric, there is. There is, but there it's is. not brown. There is scent, okay, in negativo in este caso. There is scent, a brown bookshelf, okay. Porque no hay una café, sino que es, es white. I think it's white. Key number three, Mauricio. A plant under the bed. False. Okay, there is. There, there are. Is there is scent. Okay, correct. There isn't a plant under the bed. There isn't a plant under the bed. Yes. Erica, number four, two balls on the floor. There are two balls on the floor. Yes, correct. Okay, Mario. Two bunks beds. There are. There one. are two bunks beds. Two. Okay. Number, well, next, Carla, Noemi. There is not a there. yellow one is bad. Okay. Let's see, okay. There is no. There is not, or there is no. There is not. Okay. There is not a yellow tennis ball. Oui. Sorry. Okay, next, Lourdes. Sí. La siguiente, a pink rocking horse. Rocking horse es el caballito que está ahí. There is no. There is not, okay. A pink rocking horse. Next, Veronica. Many books on the bookshelf. Um, eh, ¿Qué es bookshelf, profe? Bookshelf es, eh, es como el estante. Mm. Es... There is on the bookshelf. 
Pero books es en plural. Para Sería plural, they, they are. There, there are, yes. Mm -hmm. There are. Okay, there are many books on the bookshelves. And the last one, Jose Ovidio. Some toys in the box. There are. There are, correct. Excellent. Okay, so it's clear this part. Yes. Yes. Okay. Okay. Here also we have a another exercise but we miss the reading okay this reading two special houses in the american southwest hi everyone in this class you'll develop skills and hi everyone details. Reading. Two special houses in the American Southwest. In San Antonio, Texas, there is a purple house. This house is the home of Sandra Cisneros. Ms. Cisneros is a Mexican-American writer. She is famous for her interesting stories. The house has a porch with a pink floor. The rooms are green, pink, and purple. There are many books and colorful paintings. Many other houses near Ms. Cisneros's house are white or beige, so her house is very different. Some of her neighbors think her house is too colorful, but Ms. Cisneros loves it. Every year, Many people visit Arizona to learn about Native American tribes. Most people stay in hotels, but some people stay in traditional Native American homes called Hogan's. Lorraine Nelson, a teacher from Arizona, invites visitors to stay in her Hogan. It has three chairs, two beds on the floor, and a wood-burning stove. Ms. Nelson teaches her guests about Native American traditions. Okay. Now let's do the exercise. It's the last one. Read and select the correct articles from each house. Okay, first we have Sandra Cisneros house. Okay, there is a, what objects uh, you can find in that house? Many or books. With a big floor. There is a, Porch with a pink floor. There is a porch with a pink floor. Okay. Number two, there are colorful, colorful paintings. paintings. Colorful paintings. Paintings. And there are many, many books. books. 
many books. Okay, then we have Laura Lorraine Nelson's house. There is a good, good morning. morning. Stop. Mm. He's right. Mm. Wood burning. Okay, what else? There are three, three shares. And there are two. Two, two bedrooms. Two bedrooms. Two bedrooms. Two bed. Two bed. Two bed. bed on the floor. On the floor. Two bedrooms or two beds? Ah, two beds. Two beds. Two beds. In the floor. In the floor. In, in the floor. or in? in the floor. On the floor. In. On the in floor. In. 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 Are you sure? Yes. In. So that's on. ¿Quién dijo in? Pero la toma mal. Yo la ah, pero really? Sí, ajá, la toma la mala. Toma. Ah, ok. Es in. Ah, sí, vi que habían puesto uh -huh. también eso. But the correct is on. O, o sea, en la plataforma no, ¿verdad? Pero la forma correcta es on. Porque in es adentro. No podemos tener camas adentro del, del piso, sino que están sobre, on, on the floor. That's the correct answer. Ok. So, that's the last exercise. And let's see. Colocha. Okay. Mm -hmm. so this, this part. We have a few minutes. Three minutes. Okay. Describe um, that there is or there isn't, or there are, or there aren't in the in the house. Okay, tell me a sentence. Let us start with the living room. Araceli, una oración usando there is, there are, o en negativo. Mm, there are some chairs in the living room. They are in the living room? No, they are in the kitchen. Entonces en negativo. Uh, there yes. aren't. There aren't. In the, li in the kitchen. In the living room. Uh. Okay. There are not chairs in the living room. There are no chairs in the living room. Okay, Alison, otra acerca del living room? There is a television in the living room. Okay, yes. Eric, otra the living room? There is a television. Ya la dijeron, ya la dijeron otra. There, there are two pictures on the living room. Ok. In, in the living room. O también podríamos decir there are two pictures on the wall. On the wall, en la pared. Ok. Yes. Vamos ahora con la kitchen, Mauricio. Kitchen. There is a table in the kitchen. There is a table in the kitchen. Erica, kitchen. 
There is a stove in the kitchen. There is a stove, correct. Mario kitchen. There are uh, fighting in the kitchen. There are? There are fighting. Paintings. They are Painting. not in the kitchen. No están in the kitchen. Están in the living room. Uh, uh, there are no. There are no. <laughs> <laughs> there are no paintings <laughs> in the kitchen. Okay. <laughs> yes. Carla, in the bedroom. They are uh, a mirror. In the bedroom. bedroom. Como es singular, ¿cómo sería? Es there, there is. There is. Eh, a. A miro. In the bedroom. Excellent. Lower this. Bedroom. There are. And the picture there in the bedroom. There, there are on the mirror. There are here on the mirror. Yes, there is. Puede decir cosas que no hay también. Ayúdele, Verónica. No things. They are in the clothes. There aren't any any clothes. 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 Okay. A clock. A clock. A clock. Uh -huh. clock. Yes. Okay. Correct. Yes, Karen. There aren't curtains in the bedroom. Okay. Yes. There aren't any curtains in the bedroom. Excellent. Okay, it's time. And I know you have a lot of things to do. So see you on Monday, okay? Bye-bye, take care. Bye. Monday. Bye. Good night. Bye-bye, Thank you. Bye-bye.